What you're looking at here is the Dorano Echo Farm video. We are here right now in the Dorano Echo Farm. This is the garden collection of Sonia Dorano. It is open to the public. So this way, garden and nursery, they also have a swimming pool. But this is something that is not really been popularized in the mid popularized in media and all that so we might as well show you around because there's still more around Cebu Island than what we have been showing you so this one here this is his her I'm um, sorry her bonsai collection you got the Bogunbelia bonsai Ficus bonsai and there's a big one on the back so then you go here this is the fern collection see the Sonia fern collection by in loving memory of Sonia Durano wife of there's your her memorial there so that's the fern collection are we so you can see there's a lot of people here because the garden tour is actually free so we are now here inside the other side of the Dorano Echo Farm so we're going down to where the eight um, the <laughs> known eight swimming pools around here so we will be showing showing you what is it because this is not a lot of people knows about this the Dorano Echo Farm not a lot has been here as well but we noticed there's a lot of cars parked so there's a lot of people down there so going down you can see the cottages now there's one there on climbing up to the top of the tree so it's still a way a long way down so this is not for the people that don't like the climbing up and down this narrow steps yep hmm? oh omg when in this two gonna be finished with her ordeal. You bring 100 kilos of rice. rice. <laughs> you will be here for one month. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. I don't know the ending of the hit What? What's the occasion? Interesting. Oh, we'll have a look. As you can see, it has more people than the Mangitnit Cave. Oh, Mangitnit, middle of the earth mountain resort. Oh my god. Oh, very good, very nice. Oh, so the swimming pool goes down there. Moni Permiro de Riga, Napa did Toga. Napa did Toga. Oh, last night. Napa dong, ra? We did a skilly dedo. So this is how the swimming pool looks like here in the Dorano Echo Farm. So entrance is 100 pesos. One K. Oh, for the cottages is one K. So again, the people just have their mats and tables and chairs. So.
Here's another pool. Very interesting pool. One, two, three, four. Because we were told that there's about eight small pools here. Oh my god. So, there's another one there. And another one here. You can actually do a tour. Okay. bigger so that the water from there flows here and it's cascading down towards the next poles dili siya kalaw ka iday sir no pandaggo oh so it's not so deep here he said about four feet and then here it's a bit five feet <laughs> so you can see more older children around here <laughs> yes So this is bigger and also laum siya dang. This is about five feet. So this is like um, dedicated for adults. Uh, not really adults because there are children, but the children that can swim. So we go further on. <clears throat> oh. There is another one here. But the way it is designed, amazing. It's following the nature's way. Not your typical swimming pool. It's Saturday. That's when the family bondings happen because Sunday, usually, agui. And so that was there on the other side. That's the actual river of the Echo Farm. I'll go on the other side to have a look. look. Lagi, lagi. Okay, okay. Dia lang kaga. Gilang, gilang. Ah, okay, Roy. Malabang rin lagi ko ni. Diha, Roman. Diha, Roman. Galagi, okay, Roy. Gina. Ah, ano na lang, Roy. Bili na niya, Roy. So, there is eight pools around here. Eight small pools that is designed like it is in the nature's way. Dili dan log, sir. Dili lagi dan log. Okay na lagi na. Ang tanaw ta dito. Dili, dili. Dili lagi na. Ano ara ka dia? Ka diot ra? Mahubo ra ba yan? Hang on. I'll just take out my shoes. Mahubo ra ba yan? I'll just take out my shoes so I can get a shot of the river thing.
So this is the river where the water source of their swimming pool coming from. Here in Durano Echo Farm, you can see the force of the cascading water from the mountain top. Even some would rather s swim or take their whatever selfies here on the river than on the pool. This is part of the Durano Echo Farm. And that's the number eight pool in there. So you can see someone there in her bikini for selfie. And it is different, you know? Eight little swimming pool that you can choose from where you want to uh, swim or you can actually swim on the river I was not so impressed so much with the garden collection but I am impressed here with the actual echo farm swimming pools and swimming area There you are. So someone there has been dancing in the pool. It's amazing, you know. If you want different sort of area for family bonding, Try the Durano Echo Farm on the way to the fa Cebu Safari. Today is Saturday because Sunday usually most of these are closed. So you can see some of the lads would l rather trek to the raging river, look. You might skid, look, as part of their adventure. So there you are, the Dorano Echo Park. So this is the best part here in the Dorano Echo Farm. Is the eight swimming pools that they have you can choose from and they also got the natural river for you to swim if you are um like you just want to swim on nature the only thing is like a lot of steps going down a lot of steps going up if you're not keen on those kind of steps on the narrow pathways then this is not the thing for you but for those adventure seeker this is one resort that you should visit 100 pesos per person you can rent the tables at 100 pesos and with four chairs or something and additional will be 20 pesos per chair or you can even stay overnight and you stay on the cottages like this up on the tree there's three or four here that you're actually living on the tree house so I was wondering where are all these people coming from there there's another tree house that you can rent like 1,500 a night so there you go the Dorano Echo Farm so we were told with the directions to go 
It's not been taken care of. Because yeah. it's... There is the garden garden there, but we have to... You know? Look, all the plants. Just ordinary plants do. It's only ordinary plants. I mean, it can have been a... It could have been a beautiful garden if it's been taken care of. But you know, it's free. So, it's just left like this. You know, you don't, you don't like <laughs> entice to go around. Because, look. Let's go outside, let's go there. Okay. Put us underneath. Go look at the garden. Nothing much to see, you know. There's her bonsai collections. It's more of a bonsai collection showcasing. It's not kind of impressive thing. It's not been well it's taken like care. Drafting. Yes. Drafted. Look. Look at all this bonsai collection. You said there's an orchid collection there. Yeah. Yeah. Look at this one, oh. It's already coming out of the if we follow the path so it's not really an impressive eco farm or garden as whatsoever you know it could have been nice look at all the photos this is you know variegated photos photos plant So, Durano Echo Farm. Let's see the orchid collection. Perhaps it's better. All the or the bonsai collection there. Look. The big giant photos on the mango tree. There. That's quite looking nice there. On the mango tree. But overall, Look, even the orchid collection is not even, it's so different. It's not been taken care of. <laughs> oh, rubbish. <laughs> Look what inside these beautiful things there. There's some rare plants. Mm-hmm.